Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport 2. Today is episode number 28. If you guys do enjoy the content, then be sure to leave a like, as it really does help with the YouTube algorithm at the moment. Feel free to subscribe, drop a follow on Twitch, and hopefully you enjoy the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Alright, we're here for another event, starting off with Sakuba Circuit, moving over to Magello, Silverstone, Suzuka, and New York Circuit. And we're taking part in the Class C World Trophy. Let's go. Right. Attempt number two. One. Go. Not bad. There we go. Lovely. Got around those first few corners fairly nicely. And the uh, controller didn't disconnect again. Like last time. Which is kind of funny. Oh, and I finally got that uh, WRC Plus. So I'm extremely excited to watch that. I think by the time this comes out, I will have watched my first episode of it. Or oh, my first ever rally. Like fully live. Every single stage. Not bad. You've got structure. You're gonna leave her. It's gonna be action. Yeah. Yeah. Good old classic pendulum. Not too bad. Got structure. I'm gonna leave ya. Not bad. Nice. We got this. Mm-hmm. 
You can see the guy's hand that actually moved to change the gears. I've just noticed that and it's kind of funny. Because he's so aggressive with it. It's like, whoop. Some of the slower cars are still on their... I've only just started lap 5. We're over halfway through lap 5 now. Beep, 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 beep. Got structure. Gonna leave ya. Gonna be action. <laughs> Got structure. Gonna leave ya. It's gonna be action. <laughs> Got structure. Not bad. There we go. Boo, 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 boo. I don't even know what you're gonna do. Not quite able to uh, catch up with the cars ahead, but we have a substantial lead. Oh, I forgot to get a thumbnail for the last cars. We'll get a thumbnail uh, from this race and also from... We'll just make one for the last episode. Can't believe I just completely forgot. Not bad. I'll take my reward. All right, here we go. Miguelo, race number two. Amaroth. Good start so far. Going down the main straight.
Not bad. Yellow circuit. This track is beautiful, by the way. I just love it so much. A little bit of curb there. Not bad. Cars behind are looking um, fairly tight together, to be honest. Not, they're not normally that close. Yeah, you see about five of them in a line with each other. This golf loves it around this course, by the way, around Miguelo. It's definitely got the speed beyond its normal top speed. It definitely has more top speed compared to the other cars. It's definitely on the heavier side though, which means in the corners, it's probably struggling a little bit more. Because the tires have to grip more and all that stuff. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. This car's definitely struggling in these uh, chicanes, 100%. It's not doing as great as I would like it to be doing. Not bad. We've got three more laps after this. I am definitely exhausted. I'm surprised why I'm so tired. But I am shattered. I'm going to edit the two videos tonight. Probably render them as well at the same time. And then tomorrow night I'm going to edit, render on Tuesday. Take my life and fade
Not bad. Bird. Like a bird, like screaming outside my window. Nope. We're in the grass and the gravel. Charming. go. Jesus fuck. A fucking pigeon flew onto our roof. Which is like right by my window. Oh my god, I'm gonna i I'm gonna get like pigeon repellent. Or pigeon traps. Kill the fuckers. They're annoying. Alright, here we go. Race number three, Silverstone. Oh, we should have taken a Mercedes. That would have been nice. I would have actually liked to have taken that Mercedes. Oh, this is four laps around the full track. Okay. The other cars are right behind. Which is uh, not ideal. I will be honest. Coming towards Club Corner now. I think this is Club Corner. Off of memory. And uh, me, myself, I've actually been in uh, that building there. Right there on the uh, corner of that pit lane. Specifically the building on the upper level. And uh, I'm pretty sure, even today, it looks exactly the same. slow down so much on that curb it shouldn't have
Not bad. Looking good. I don't know why. I feel there's a charm that's missing in the new Silverstone that old Silverstone has. I think it's that underpass bridge. I don't know why. That entire section where it sort of dips down and then comes back up. I think that is what's missing on the new Silverstone. That entire section. Which is kind of obvious because the new route doesn't go that way. But, you know. Oh, it's not going to be long before I'm shaving this entire beard off. Going again. Once more. <laughs> might do it tonight, actually. I might shave it off tonight. bad. Hold your colors against the There we go. Soaking through. Not bad. Oh, there we go. Looking crisp and fresh and clean and all that shiz. My hair's ruined. My hair is ruined. I sort it out. It's bugging me.
And there we go. Across the line. Not too bad. We'll take that result and the money. We got level 31 next race. By the way, anyone watching on YouTube, we're currently two followers away on Twitch till we hit 900, which is pretty awesome. So uh, if you are watching this on YouTube and you've gotten this far into the video, what are you doing? Why are you not following on Twitch? But on a more serious note, if you do want to help support, any way possible, it's greatly appreciated. I have an Instagram page, Twitter page, TikTok page. Basically any page you can think of on the main platforms. I greatly appreciate any support you can throw in my way. And if you know of a friend that might like these videos, feel free to share it. Same with the streams. Not bad. Now that I've actually started playing this and we're getting into the later stuff in this game, I, I actually changed my prediction of it being short than Motorsport 1. I think this is going to take about 75 videos. It's going to be a slightly longer than Motorsport 1. Not by much. But yeah, now I realize there's actually some pretty substantial scale to this game that does make it a little bit bigger than the last one. Oof! Back on track, though. Five laps looks pretty good around here. So funny, we're going to be doing another, I, I might be doing another, um, what's it called, 12 hour stream once we finish Motorsport 2. Not too bad. I do like that these professional ones are done similar to the championships in the last game, but they're a little more lenient to how they were before. Oh, but I also do keep forgetting that some of the events are pretty much very large amount shorter in this game than the other one. Hmm. It's definitely tough to sort of like pick and choose which one's going to be longer and which one isn't. Oh, 
Not bad. Bum 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 bum. Tarantula. Right, one more lap. Let's go. New, 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 new. New, 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 new. There you go. Lovely jubbler. too bad coming around spoon final time in this v wobble u and then we got one more race in the v dub bingo bingo i wonder if i gotta pay for that damage i hope i don't yeah, I don't. Woohoo! I get to damage a car for free. I'll take that, thank you. Alright, let's go for our final race in the V-Dub. Can I get a hi? Charming. <laughs> Welcome back to the chat, Kate. Seven laps around New York. Gonna be pretty good. Gonna do this, and then I'm gonna binge watch some rallying whilst also um, editing s these two videos. I really can't be asked to do more than two today. Chat's been extremely quiet, so. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, 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 meow. I had a comment <laughs> on YouTube from a, a, a Mr. Lucas. I think it was Lucas. Um, oh! Oh, I overdone it just a bit. Still fine structurally. That's good. Um, what's it called? I had a comment which was basically saying how this entire walkthrough... Is basically bad singing from mech and driving. <laughs> Which is kind of true. There's a lot of bad singing. A lot of bad driving. And a lot of talking about crap. But that's the charm. And that's why everyone should enjoy it. <laughs> Microsoft Game Studios. Oh, another collision. Woohoo! Yay! 
Yeah, exactly. What I normally do. Normally chat a lot of shit. Random shit. Why is that thing, that board up there, still advertising the old Forza Motorsport? That's the one thing that confuses me about this map. So they updated everything, but forgot to update. And there's another one up there, advertising Forza Motorsport 1. As if someone who's bought Forza Motorsport 2 is going to buy a significantly worse game to in enjoy on their new system. Seems a bit strange. I will also be extremely disappointed if I don't see a Forza Motorsport 2 advertisement in Motorsport 3. Nah, they wouldn't do that. They wouldn't do it twice. Do you know what is extremely weird about this game? So, I know a lot of games nowadays show, like, advertising boards based off of what game you're playing. So that if there's a clip of it on the internet, it's fairly, you know, well established. It's like, oh yeah, this is where it's... I don't know whether it was because YouTube came out in 2005 that they then were like, hmm, in 2007, let's add our game name to pretty much everything here so everyone knows what game that footage is from but it is kind of baffling because well why did they have it so much because for me personally I don't think YouTube took off until 2010 like properly took off for like gaming and stuff like that and making it more accessible for people to just upload their clips and it was 2013 when the new consoles came out and you could literally record videos with your console that it properly took off that was like 2014 actually it was December 2013 oh I've ruined it Ouch. Hey, look, we got a Mercedes with engine problems. Woohoo! You got a mech with suspension problems as well. What is this RX doing? Get out of the way. I'm gonna get in front of the Mercedes. Get in front of the Mercedes. If I'm not in front of the Mercedes, I'm going to cry. I really wish cars could go back to having these kind of damage models. In video games, because Gran Turismo's damage model is pointless. It's just scratches. Forza Motorsport. I don't even know what kind of damage model that game has. Other than the rear wing falling off and a couple of crumples on it. All the Horizon games are shit. Um, I think the only game when the damage physics, I've been like, wow, this damage model is pretty good. It's either BeamNG. In fact, no, BeamNG is the best damage physics model. But obviously that's PC only. In terms of a generic game... Probably more along the lines of Motorstorm. Like where you've got actual gameplay. Not just what is basically just a physics model. Because that's all that BeamNG is. It's not an actual proper game. It's just a physics model to make sure you don't crash. <laughs> or you do crash. Depending on what you want to see. Let me see your true colors. Boom! I 
I think that was my bumper I just went past. Yo, team leader, what's up? Welcome. Welcome back to the stream. How you doing? Final lap, and then we are done for today. Touch the ground. Oh, nearly. Not bad. Tasty. Uh, I'm doing good. I'm doing pretty good. We reached the end. Here we go, coming to the end of the race. Oh, very close. And there we go, across the line. Woohoo! Hosting times. Let me get my rewards and my cars and let's get out of here. 50 points. We got 11 grand because we had so much damage on our car. And we got a 2004 Audi number 8 TTR and 40 grand. We got a racing Audi TT. Oh, it's this one. Oh, this is beautiful. I forgot how big the wing on this thing was. Yeah, that's going to be fun to drive. Big time. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>